Hello friends, today I will talk about the commonly used drugs that can cause hyponatremia or low levels of sodium in the blood. Of course, more common causes are poor intake, so somebody who doesn't take adequate salt or due to losses of salt as in blue stools or vomiting. But if you look at the drugs, possibly the number one cause will be thiazide diuretics which are commonly used for treating high blood pressure. So older people who also restrict their salt and are on medications for high blood pressure, uh, namely thiazide diuretics, they can have uh, hyponatremia because of a loss of sodium in the urine. The second most common drug overall will be SSRIs, which are selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors commonly used for treating depression. And the commonly used drugs in this list are sertraline estaloprem. So especially in older adults, in the first few weeks of treatment, uh, low sodium levels can happen. And in our neurology practice, uh, the drugs which are commonly linked with low sodium are oxcarbazepine and carbazepine. Again, older adults uh, where this can happen. So whenever uh, there are symptoms of hyponatremia like lethargy, weakness or you know feeling dull, uh, drowsiness, and in severe cases, even uh, you know, drop in consciousness levels, coma and seizures may occur. And if patients are taking these medications like thiazide diuretics or antidepressants like SSRIs and oxcarbazepine, think of uh, low sodium. And a simple blood test can detect it and it can be easily treated uh, with uh, simple measures.